Ni hao guys and welcome back to you one Chao story with me NG Paradox. Last time we just started off the attack against the yellow turbans and it's about to cumulate with the assault upon the city of Yi. If that's how you pronounce it, currently we have the advantage once my men get there. So let's jump right in. 51,000 men against 32,000. Sao Tsao versus the leader of the rebellion. We're jumping right in because even though maybe this might be an easy battle, we want to see the heroes upon either sides. Like I said, we want to make this feel like an immersive story. The people we meet, the heroes we see, the enemies we see. Who dies and who lives, we want to know it all. Bao Xin and Hong Fu Song. Hong Fu Song is going right into the mix there. Really getting into the enemy territory. Tiang Feng is actually with the enemies right now. He's a yellow turban. Interesting. Zhang Yan, Su Gu, uh, Zhang Jiao is defending the uh, main camp. And there's the rest of the men there like Zhang He. We've got Lu Ji. Okay, and uh, me and Sao Tso at the back here. Okay, Sao Tso, well, I'm going to head forward, I think. Let's get to the bridge there. Let's get to the bridge there and maybe try and attack them. Zhang Hong captured that point. Good, good, good. They're trying to take this. They got that. Where will they go now then? Will they go south? Will they go middle? These guys are trying to get back. We haven't got any horses for me. So they're, they're a bit faster than I am. Oh, there we go. Battle starting here. Zhang He versus Zhang Yan. Go Zhang He. I've always been a fan of Zhang He. But the Iron Mountain tactic. Ooh, across all of there. So that should give them a slight advantage possibly. Got equal men, but... 6,000 more men here. That won't be enough. I need to go in the help. We need to go and help as well. Let's go, go, go. Reinforce Zhang He. Go, Yuan Shao. Okay, now to make sure that... Okay, Hong Fu Song is taking on all the other enemies to give me time to get there. Thank you, Huang. We'll go around behind them. Because you can see there, they're getting good attacks against him. Let's get behind him, make sure he loses. <gasps> Cheng Wangji and Hong Fu Song are going to duel. Cheng Wangji is a yellow turban, but I've se we've seen him in previous um, series that we've done. I think my You Do series, he might have been a, a part of that, possibly. But he's fighting Hong Fu Song. Hong Fu Song has put himself in danger for all of us. But he now must face them in a duel. Hong Fu Song is probably the winner in this. Oh no, his duel is actually not that good, is it? Yeah, he's really good at leading men. But not dueling. Ooh. This could be uh, Cheng Wangji. This could be his time to shine. And dueling one as well. Ooh, this is actually uh, a bit... Look at that. Big hit there. Go on. Oh, draw there. Please defend. Oh, no. Hong Fu Song. You are a worthy opponent. Strong words. You're a worthy opponent, strong I'm not sure you guys heard each other in that that swap there, but here we go. Both did unbalance. Remember, Hong Fu Song is the Viceroy. He's like second in command. Well, I guess third. Well, he lost the duel there. I don't think he died, though. I think he's fine. Defeated him in the duel. Yeah, he was defeated. The morale will go down, but he's fine overall. Uh, we'll take him on from this side. Should we do a show of splendor? Allies. I'm not near Hong Fu. If I was near Hong Fu Song, I would do that. There we go. This guy should be taken care of. Lu Ji. Taken that. Activate that, maybe. Yeah, activate that for Hong Fu Song. Hold on, Hong Fu Song. We're taking care of this guy and we'll come support you. The others now can go attack the leader, Zhang Jiao. 200 men there. And there we go. Wiped out. Let's go. I can do my show of splendor. We can't let him escape. Go, go, go. Okay, taking out them. These guys are going to try and stop them. He's got 8,000 versus 7,000. Yeah, we'll chase after these guys. He did defeat him in combat. Uh, we'll come from this side. And I'll use show of splendor. Here we go. Show of splendor! The glory of Yon, Yuan Zhao! Yuan Shao! Also, my own, own name wrong there. God. 
Okay. They're looking bad. They get a bit more support, though. Zhang He. Captured that point. This guy's had a bit of trouble, though. He's not got many men left. He's doing okay. If we can give him the back. Oh, fire! Who did she use fire? Okay, just let them burn then. Was that my own guy? Okay, if he tries to get out, just attack him. Don't let him out. He left. Okay. Now go back to attacking this guy. Okay, here we go. They're all taking this camp. Reinforcements. Oh, shouldn't you? Okay, that's our own men. No need to worry there. We've got this. 12,000 men versus 60,000? I, um... I feel we have a slight advantage here. Ah, oh, Tian Feng. He's all on his own. Look at that. His morale is gone completely. Nothing he can do. And only their leader remains. Oh, Zhang Chao was appointed as governor of the city that I'm currently in. To make for Chang'an at once. Why am I going to Chang'an? Have I been making... I will head straight towards Chang'an. Have I been made governor of Chang'an? Yes, we were made a governor. See, we're finally being recognized for our glory. See, the battlefield is where we should make a name. Hong Fu Song was happy with my help. Even after he lost the duel, I came in to support him. Well, let's kill this guy. Done. And 200 men left. Oh, dear. You the heavens! No! And there we go, we've done it. We've taken the city. Ye falls. This is the first step in defeating the Yellow Turban Rebellion. Look at Zhang He. I mean, look at him. I came second, though. We did quite well. We only just came behind Zhang He. Pretty good scene as we entered the, you know, fight a bit later as well, you know. We should be taken. Oh, no, it actually was. It was just slightly outside the city. Okay, so we're sieging it down then. Okay. But I meant to be going to Chang'an. Am I the Chang'an Liu Biao? No, I've been... Okay, I've been sent to Chang'an underneath Liu Biao. Liu Biao is an important statesman. We saw him in the, the court before. Um, you know, the, the, when we see someone with the Lu, L-I-U, they tend to be related to the Emperor. Maybe distantly, but there's still kind of, there's a connection there with the Han Dynasty. And Liu Biao was an important man in the Central Plains. Hold, holds Liu Bei there for a long time. He's important to the story. Only 76 days until Attack City is over. Okay, that's fine. Oh, more men. Zhang Ji. We won't do it again. That one's done. It's fine. They raised more men there again. So I've been I've not been given a governorship, but here we go. Oh, he dismissed me as minister. Hong Fu Song? Yeah, that always, that always happens. Liu Biao now has appointed me his minister of Chang'an. Would this seal become the military minister? Very well, fine. I'll be ending if Liu Biao. Maybe we could become friends of him. Who knows? New relationships are plenty. Oh. No? Okay, so now Hong Fu Song actually wants me to come back to his council and be the Minister of Domestic. Okay. Alright. I hate when the AI does this. So now back underneath Hong Fu Song. Okay. We built something there, apparently. More men have joined in, but it's not enough. They're sending as many men as... They're just going to waste all their men in this battle. Which could make it easier to take the other cities later. After we win this battle. And we've conquered Yi. Yi has fallen. Two officers, including Zhang Jiao, have been captured by my force. So we captured Zhang Jiao. And of course, he's been executed. That damn traitor. Humph. I thought this might happen. Oh! The traitor of the Han Dynasty. How dare he? Zhang Bao, his brother, has now succeeded. I'm going to be governor. Oh, so the city we just took. I've been named as governor. Yuan Shao, the hero of Yi. That's what we'll be known as. Okay, so I, I'm now the governor of the city that we just took. Thank you, Hong Fu Song. I'm liking Hong Fu Song. I already liked him, and now I like him even more. 
Ding Wan has captured Ju Lu. Okay, so you can see Ding Wan has made a move there. Uh, Liu Yan has made a move over here. Gong Shu Zan has made a move up here. Yeah. Everyone's at least got one more city now. What about down the bottom? They're about to go get one as well. But none of them are really attacking the yellow turbans apart from this one that they just took. We could see more fall though, but here we go. This is mine. I probably should go home. But my company, I'm still leading a ten, an 18,000 man army. I can't really leave right now. We should really press on and take more. But where would we go next? We could go to Puyang. There's Zhang Bao, the current lead of the forces. So we have, oh, Zhang Bao is not there. Where's Zhang Bao? Is he leading some men? He must be leading some men currently. He must be leading some men somewhere. If we go quick into the information, we can go click on them. There we go, Zhang Bao. Uh, Ban Shi, Dang Mao, He Jin, Zhang He, Se Yong, Wang Yong. Doesn't say the district though, which is always a shame. I wish I actually told you the di the actual uh, districts as that on that as well. That'd be kind of nice. But okay. Uh, we'll see what the other armies do. Looks like we're just defending. Are they actually attacking? No, they're taking. They're staying here. Okay, now they're going to attack. We won't. We won't fight in that one. There's no need. There's so many men on our side. It's ridiculous. Honors. Okay, my wife did the best because we just became the the governor. So there wasn't really many people to look at. Is there actually anyone in the city? There's no one in this city, actually, right now. Just me and my wife. That's the only people in this city. We've got a prisoner of Guangdu. So we captured him with his uh, master, Zhang Liao. Zhang Zhao. But uh, this guy's around. Officer of the Yellow Turbans. After the Yellow Turbans defeated, uh, led a gang of bandits in Runan. Cooperated with Liu Bei and Yuan Shao at the Battle of Gu Nu. By attacking the rear of Cao Cao's army. Was struck down by Sha Hao Yuan. Okay, uh, war's not too bad. You can normally tell who was a yellow turban by the fact they have a yellow turban on. A lot of those characters, it's quite hard to remember who they are and stuff. Because, you know, they genuinely at the very beginning of the story or in the history and uh, then they disappeared. So they're going to go forward. Do we just go forward and take this, Gangling? Or do we go forward to Nanpi? Nanpi is 5,000. A lot of men overall. Maybe we just put, just push in the north then. Seeing as we're here, let's advance to Gangling. There's not many men there. Let's march upon it, all together now. Let's go. Because they're going to be attacked by Lu Bu, the fierce warrior. Lu Bu is fine, the yellow turbans as well. Um, we don't need to lead that. They've got so few men, and our officers are amazing compared to theirs right now. Hopefully more will come to support. There we go. We may not need more, but they've got 18,000 men coming now. So we may need some support. We're we'll going to fight this one. Here we go. That's that's what I call a battle then. We're facing in Zhang Liang, one of the brothers right there. So if Zhang Bao dies, Zhang Liang would take over as lead of the Yellow Turban. So maybe we could capture him here and now. We will have a war council before the battle. If you have any views to share, let me hear them. I, Sad Chao, should be the main strategist myself. Follow my plans. Okay, so we're in our force out, so... He's going to take the lead. Judging by the terrain, the enemy main strategist, Zhang Liang, has to be after the spear strike tactic. Now, how to deal with that? This plan is our key to victory. It's the same battlefield as last time. Are you kidding me? Game, come on. Prayer tactic, archer trap tactic, and discipline tactic. Yeah, it's, it's fine by me. Just me and Sao Tsao, basically. Fighting side by side. No, we'll take his plan. Me and Sao Tso, you know, we're friends right now, you know, for now, you know, it could change, like in history, but for now, we're friends. So, we'll, we'll take him on this, um, we will attack this city. Let's go, Sao Tso, I mean, yeah, let's go, Sao Tso. 5,000 men, we could take him down. Yeah, no one in particular noticed there, apart from Zhang Liang. Maybe we don't want to get that. You might want to capture that. But Sao Tso is joining me. He Jim Army exceeded the time limit. We're fine. 
Okay, we'll take down this guy. He's got 5,000 minis on his own. But if he comes to help, I could be in trouble. We'll see. Maybe Southside's going that way. They're they could go behind us now. They've got horses. It would be hard to stop them. That would be up to Southside. Then again, he could get there first. Attack that guy. In, okay, or just attack this. South is attacking them. I should head back. Their men together could fight him. So I should head back to protect against him. Because he's going to attack R1. He might be able to defeat both of them. But he'll be attacked from both sides. But this guy, we can't let him attack our place while he's, no one's here to defend it. Because South South can't take that straight away. Or at least I can distract him. Yep, he's going straight for the main camp. Of course he is. Here we go. We're coming, main camp. Southtail, hold on for now. He, he can hold them. We know we know he's capable. Look, he's holding them off for now. He's actually doing a very good job. And here we go. Perfect. The council determined its city assault. Okay, so we're going completely in against the other turbans. The district, though. Strong domestic. Okay. I'm going to show Splendor. The Splendor of Yuan Shao. Go. That should be him down. Look at that. He's got nothing. Sao Tso's holding on. He's even winning. So really no problems here. Al. Look at that. Absolutely destroyed. Let's try and capture him. Come on. Or face him in a duel. That would be even more epic. Wiped him out. Got Gallant for that. I captured him. Perfect. We did capture him. Now let's head to their camp. They've only got 500 men. Look at that. South, no, South, South. They have like 500 men. You only lost like a thousand men. Maybe even less than that. That was crazy, South, South. I mean, I did pretty well as well, but you know. Now we're swapping, are we? Okay, fine, South, South. Do what you want. Luckily, these guys aren't horses, so we can deal with this. Okay, he's out. We captured him as well. Good job, Yuan Shao. He's capturing all these delinquents. And here we go. More yellow turbans defeated. Great, Yuan Shao comes top of the pack. Zujin, you know, he comes third. I simply fought for my life. Everyone did well. Let us continue in the future. Uh, m maybe if I become such good friends of Satsa, maybe I could get him, and he gets defeated by someone else, maybe I could get him to join my force. Could you imagine that? Satsa working for Yuan Shao? I mean, it just it just seems unprecedented, to be honest. Uh, there's Tian Feng again. We need to get past this. They're all going back. Hong Fu Song is going home, apparently. Strongholds in shambles. Maybe while I'm doing this, we could hire some more... Per no, I can't. Okay, that's fine. We will not fight that, because that's a pretty easy one right there. Yeah, you can see, look at that. 191 for attack, 192 for defense. He's already dead. Uh, Lu Bu stopped his attack. So still, like, 16,000 men. We need to get through another stronghold. Uh, the other men are going to attack uh, Pu Yang. Currently, it's being led by Zhang He. 29,000 men against Deng Mao and his 9,000. They should be able to take that city as well. Looking pretty good. And those are the two main parts of the battle. Sun Jian is expanded even more right now. And looks as though Dong Zhuo is attacking the northwest of uh, Ma Teng. They're currently fighting one and one there. Ma Teng has the better officers, it looks like, and better attack and defense. But Dong Zhuo has more men. I would say he's probably going to win that. But we got 3,000 men attacking the city from behind. Look at that. So Dong Zhuo's in a good tactic there. He's caught him in battle and sent a sneaky little force behind to capture the city. And that'll put Ma Teng in a very bad position there. Okay. Let's go back though to our city. Oh, there's another army down here. Let's go back though to our assault. Go back to our assault. Oh, Ding Wan. There we go. Dong Zhuo has taken that city. 11,000 men. He's going to find it quite difficult to take that city, but at least he'll distract them. And that's what we want. I have enough, definitely enough men to take these cities. Look at that. Floods. No one owns those lands, though. Zhang Bao has built of achievements to be known as the Mastermind. Very well. Okay. Damn these yellow turbans. Becoming more prestigious. How dare they? 
9,000 men here. We can take that if they raise a force there. They need to protect it from this, so we're fine. Here we go, then, to take the city. Sun Zhong must fall. Sao Tzu is probably going to lead this. Oh, he's going to lead the plan into me. So Sao Tzu says, you know, I did the battle last time. Yuan Shao, I trust you enough now. I'm going to let you make the tactic for this. Oh, or Bian. Oh, he meant Bian. Oh, thanks, Sao Tzu. He got my hopes. I thought he was talking about me. He was talking about his wife. I think that's his wife, yeah? Bian Shi. Ah. Okay, fine. He doesn't trust me. <laughs> uh, no, we'll leave it for now. Oh, but Zhu Jun does take issue with that plan. Hmm. Okay, Zhu Jun. He thinks this one is better. Well, there are two defense posts here. It would be easier to go this way. So maybe this... I actually agree with that, probably. Yeah, I think Zhu Jun is the better idea. We should attack from this side. He's only got one army there. We don't need to be risky. We but Satsao is siding with his love, Bian Shi. Hmm. Satsao, I think you're letting your personal preferences get in the way there. I mean, Zhu Jun, I'm pretty sure he's a pretty capable commander, if I can remember from the book. I'm pretty sure. Um, but yeah, but fine, okay, it's, it doesn't matter, we're gonna win this. Let's begin. God, gotta work underneath Satsao. It's weird though, because I'm technically leading the men. But he leads in the battle, so it's kind of like we, we have, I'm, I'm the one in charge of where we go and stuff, but then he's the one in charge of the actual battle, which actually, that would actually be maybe not the worst thing, actually, <laughs> in the end of the day. Um, but yeah, let's just go take this, this little fort here. Let's try, we should probably try and tent them out, because they do have horses, so it will be hard to capture him. But Sun Zhong, he's the only man left in this city. He's the only one defending it. Does he have any other people with him? He has Han Yin as well. So him and Han Yin are the only two officers here in the entire city. We've only got 6,000 men. We've got 17,000. It should be ours. Now, there could be men coming to you know, support the city or support us. We're not sure. There didn't seem to be when I was last in the, you know, the world map. So it's probably just going to be this. Okay, just catch him tactical points right now. Let's go get this, and then hopefully Tsao will attack the gate. Tsao go attack the gate, okay? Go attack the gate. No, don't come help me. Okay, fine. I guess it doesn't really matter. You know, you're, you're doing damage to one or the other. You know, be quick either way. And there we, he's going for his ability. There we go. Okay, fine. We just, we're just going to march through these gates, aren't we? Tremble in fear of Yuan Shao. And his golden armor. I have to admit, I do like the armor in this game. I do like his appearance in the game just because of the armor and stuff. It does look pretty nice. Okay, this this has fallen so quickly. See, when we work together, Tsao we could do such great things. It, <laughs> uh, this game's graphics make me laugh sometimes. I mean, it works for Three Kingdoms. It's just, it looks funny when you get a bit too close. Oh, look at his morale. His people are already feeling scared. They're already like, shit, there's... What can we do? And they're completely morale. They've completely lost their morale. Where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> I know I said attacking from behind, but even the arrow saying go that way. Okay. He gained his morale back though. When they're facing death in their face, they actually gain a bit of morale. Come around behind them, and this is dead. If you can, try and sneak around so he can't escape. There we go. Done and dusted. And it's over. Sun Zhong is out. And the city is ours. Bian Shi came second. Really good. Huh. I ranked first. Yeah, yeah, Sao Tsao. Next time you won't be so lucky. Next time. Next time. So we capture Gang Ling. Uh, Han Yin has been captured by Yuan Shao's forces. Okay, there's the other officer there. I would like to go home and actually start managing my city, but we, we can't really right now because we need to just keep assaulting. We might as well keep... We could go to Bay. Like, we could just take these 16,000 men and really just pile through and get the Yellow Turban Rebellion dealt with as quickly as possible. Uh, we'll leave that to uh, Ding Wan. We'll leave that to, uh, I'll leave that to him. Ding Wan can handle that. He's got Lu Bu probably with him. 
I'm, well, maybe he does not. I, I'm not sure, but he probably, if he, I was him, I'd be taking Lupu everywhere. You know? So he should be okay. Let's head to the next city then. Oh, we can see quite a few men down there. We took the other city. We took Puyang. It has fallen. And Deng Mao has been captured. Successfully fulfilled the ambition. There we go. So you can see the assault upon the other turbans is going very well right now. They're starting to lose their shape, their formation. There's about 20,000 men there, so we could have difficulty with to fight them. So hopefully these guys will come to help us. It's Lu Yu. Uh, there's Lu Dei. Shen Yu. Shen Yu's a great, um, great strategist, Shen Yu, if I remember correctly. Lu Ji is a good general as well. Zhang Chao. Um, Hong Fu Song. Yeah, he's, Zhang Chao is okay. Lu Yu, yeah, he's okay as well. Um, but yeah. For, for, oh, we got 12,000 men coming down. They've left this city open. Maybe we should head back and attack that city instead. Because Ding Huan is left. But are these guys attacking? Yes, they are. Okay, so Zhang Fei and Lu Yan are going to attack with about 40, 30, well, 36,000 men. There's no way they're not taking Nan Pi. So we'll, we'll let them take that, I guess. They're taking Ping Wan. Are they? They are. They're going to try and take a different city. I don't like that, but these guys are getting quite close. 20,000 men. I'm not getting any support here. I think we should retreat. We think we should take down these guys so they don't get that city. Because that'll be another city I'll have to take. So... No. Can you click on Yuan Shao? Okay, go after them. I think Because they're, they're, they're going to attack us. They're waiting. They're wait. Okay, now they're running away. There we go. That's good. Perfect. I don't know what these guys are going to do. Okay, now they're going to go that way, actually. So that's even better for me. They're going to attack with 20,000 men against... Yeah, okay. These guys should be fine. They, they'll they have no trouble at all there. Um, okay, here we go. This is Tian Feng again. He's coming with 3,000 men to defend the city, but he doesn't have the men. Oh, Shen Pei! has convinced Gong Du with the yellow turbans to work for us. So, Shen Pei was a, a man who I think should be underneath Yuan Shao in the future, or at least he's in historical records and, of course, the Three Kingdoms. Um, he's actually convinced one of the yellow turbans to come to our side. He's shown that they're winning, they're fighting a losing fight. No need to fight that battle. It's won. There we go. This should be a good fight, though. Hong Fu Song, Zhang He, Lian the fight there. 12,000 more men are coming, but who are they going to help? They're going to fight us, or they're going to help in that battle. He's got a choice to make there, Zhang Mancheng. He's got a big choice, and uh, Zhang Bao is coming as well. This battle up here is going on. Chen Wanji is losing badly to Lu Yan. Not surprised there with Zhang Fei and stuff. City assault still. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we've got this. Unless they, raise, they could raise a small army very quickly to, to hold us off. But looks like they're not going to. And they didn't. Jibei has fallen. And we captured Tiang Feng. There we go. Now they could they could attack me trying to retake the city right now. Uh, 12,000 men won't be enough and I'll have the defense. So we should be fine. They're probably going to take Nampi. So the north there for the other turbans has now fallen. It's now really just the south. And they've used so many men to fight us. We should be in a good position. But they're coming with a lot of men. So we're going to need to fight this one. But this time we get to defend. What's the plan, Sauter? You leave the plan to you. You'll, yeah, of course. Bianchi again. She's saying this and that. Um, that's fine. No, I'm fine. We'll, we'll keep with that. It's not a big deal. Okay, so for their army, what do we got here? Zhang Mancheng. We got Liu Hua. I think he's a pretty good officer, if I can remember. And Hang Zhong. So we got some, uh, some, not terrible officers there, but not as good as me and Cao Cao. <laughs> the ultimate team. So, we control every territory. So how about I go this way? I'll go this way. You go the other way, maybe Cao Cao? They are coming up this way, it looks like. Should probably capture that. And I'll go capture that. But he's got the horses, so he's a bit faster than me. That guy has horses here. We need to watch out for him. Then again, with the gates, we should be okay. The gates are a bit damaged, so we should try and be careful a bit. It's not too bad. 
Discipline tactic. Where are you going now, Cao Cao? Are you going to take this as well? I'm actually going to go fight these guys. You go take that, okay? You got the horses. You could do it. I'll go take care of these guys. You could use this, and I got the defenses here to help me. I'm not dying here. Show a splendor. Let's do it. And of course, I think we should go with this. Discipline tactic. Here we go. You fell right from my trap. There may be two of you, but I am prepared. Okay, well, if he's going to go after Cao Cao, I'll take care of this guy then. Oh, they got me a pincer attack. But Cao Cao's got him in the pincer attack. And there we go. Oh, Bajang Bao is here. He's come with quite a few men, and so has Bian Shi. Bian Shi, if I remember correctly, was one of the guys who was killed by Guan Yu in one... Maybe not one here, but he was one of the guys that was killed on his path to get back to Liu Bei. Ah, sad story. <laughs> But many of the, the men who fight for the Yellow Turbans are going to fight for other people in the future, you know. It makes sense. they got experience in war and stuff. Okay, he's been destroyed. We've got slightly less men, so we need to be a bit more careful here, but... I think... Tao Tao? Um... Okay, how about you guys follow me, then? Come to the... Come to the walls, please. That'll help me out. Okay, Tao Tao's gonna go attack... He's going to capture the, the camp there. Okay, great. That would only go around there. I'd rather have the walls on my side. Come on, fight me in front of the walls. And I will defeat you all. Oh, they're just going to go right past me, aren't they? Yep, I should have realized. Okay, they're going to go up his bit. He's going to face me one-on-one. -on -one. That's what we want. One-on-one -on -one fights. Zhang Bao, the leader of the Yellow Turbans against Yuan Shao. Here is where I stand. Show a splendor. You can't defeat me now. You don't have horses to escape. Good. That's it, walls. Take him down. This is not how I fall. Not like my brother. No. That's it. Look how many men we've lost compared to them. Absolute root right there. Now, he's going to be a problem. I could let this guy escape. It's going to be annoying to try and chase him, so I'm going to go around here and stop him from getting that. He's dead. He's out. Where is Sao Tso? Sao Tso attacking their main camp. they got 4,000 men going back. He won't be able to stop him, though. So if I get keep this guy distracted, yeah, we've won. Go, Sao Tso! Okay, we'll fight up here. I could probably use my show of splendor again. Sure, Splendor's not a bad, you know, tactic. Yuan Shao is a, a decent tactic. Not the best, of course. It won't maybe turn the tide completely, but it's very good, especially when he's surrounded by his allies and stuff, you know? He's pretty decent. I right, let's go there. Yep, they're out. I don't think we captured him, but the squad was destroyed. We protected the city from them, and I came out on top. There we go. So we gained some merit there, you know, get some glory. People will look up to me now. So. They are attacking the city. The city's theirs, so the north is fallen. Time to head south. They got 9,000 there. I say we keep going. Let's go to uh, Xiao Pei. Let's go to Xiao Pei and hit a, a big blow here. They defeat the army here, the Yellow Turbans. We can defeat this one. There's only 2,000 men here. And with that, then... The east of the Yellow Tones will be defeated as well. It'll just be the southern area. So basically, Sun Jian. God, look at you. Oh, and look at Dong Zhuo. He's expanded quite a bit up here. Ma Teng, though, holding off in that northern area. Not much left for them. Okay, so we're, we're kind of uh, both coming in here. They took that, of course. Nampi falls to Liu Bei, his friends, and of course, you know, underneath the leadership of Liu Yan. So that should be what they want, then. I'm governor of Ji Bei. Fine. Different city, then. So I make go- he wants to put me on the front lines, I feel. Hong Fu Song can see my ability. I protected the city, he wants to put me on the front lines. We do have a minister, though. He wants to go- oh, he wants to get Yu Jin! Yes! Go hire Yu Jin. Wang Kuang is an... Oh, he's, yeah, 
Yeah, Wang Kuang. He's not a bad officer to have underneath me. Who's actually in the city then overall then? We've got my wife. We've got Wang Kuang. He's uh, an okay person at everything. Prefect of Hinei and Late Han, who led a large army to the campaign against Dong Zhuo. He directed his officer Fang Yu to face Lu Bu, but was killed before he'd even fought five skirmishes. Yep. One of the guys in that campaign. Um, who else do we have here then? We have Wu Yi. Wu Yi is actually pretty good at lots of things, isn't he? Yeah, he's actually very good at lots of stuff. Officer of Shu and brother of Lu Zhang uh, by marriage. Surrendered when Lu Bei invaded Shu. Afterwards served under Lu Bei while his sister became Lu Bei's wife. Yes. Yep, Lu Zhang, of course, in the West. Ah, uh, Lu Bei, that sneaky devil taking Lu Zhang's lands. Ugh. That's why a lot. That's why a lot of people. That whole campaign in the West is why a lot of people think maybe Lu Bei was a bit more of a con sort of man than anything. But why? Well, we won't get into that right now. This guy's got pretty good intelligence. Du Shao, good governance. He's a good man to have. Minister under Yuan Shao. So having him underneath me makes sense. Uh, imprisoned for advising against the campaign against Cao Cao, when Yuan Shao lost, was offered the chance to surrender to Cao Cao, but refused. Was killed while attempting escape. You know, he's, he's a man, you know, obviously of uh, morals, his own little morals. Uh, Guang Du, the man who came to join us. There we go, one of the yellow turbans changing sides. And we got these guys in jail. Han Zhu Zi, though, is an officer we could hire. He's not that great. Um, but he was an officer of uh, of me. Huh. To defend a supply base during the deadlock at Guangdu. Oh, yes. However, all the supplies ended up torched by Sao Tso during the night time. Ah, so he was in charge of the supply base. I completely forgot his name, but that, that is an important moment. But we'll probably end this part here, guys. Guys, we'll end this part here. The yellow turbans have been pushed back. It just looks, I mean, it looks like the yellow turbans have lost. Thanks to the brilliance of Yuan Shao. And of course, Cao Cao and the, the the others. You know, Hong Fu Song, of course, did help quite a lot. Oh, Yuan Shu. You're actually doing something. Great, great, my brother. Thanks. You're finally doing something. But yeah, we should be able to make our way down south. Take that. We could probably just keep going, to be honest. So next time, hopefully, we can defeat the Yellow Turban forces. And uh, bring peace to China. Or will it? Probably not. Can we hire anyone? We can't. No, not what I'm leading right now. Okay, fine. But guys, hope to see you next time. Yuan Shao continues his campaign to get rid of the yellow turbans. We're getting a lot of prestige. We're getting a lot of honor for our work so far. We've become a governor, you know. He's rising up. Lu Yu is that. Uh, Yuan Shu is that one. Lu Ji has been given this one. Ah, Yuan Yi has been given a city. That's one of the new ones. Uh, Chao Mao has been given another one as well. Zhu Jun has been made lead uh, governor of the capital. Dong Chen and Lu Dei. So quite a few governors have changed actually in this time so far. But let's see what happens next time, guys. I'll see you then. Have a good one. Zajian.